today we are going op shopping. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Michaela and here we talk a little about reselling online in Australia and saving items from landfill and some eco-friendly business tips along the way. Today I think it's going to be one of my last thrifting days. Um, I'm seven months pregnant now and then it's Christmas next week so we're taking advantage of still feeling good and still having a lot of energy so we're going thrifting out in a town called Gloucester. First up, coffee. fantastic i love that little op shop so we're going into the next one which is just as good it's like a whole house there's like five different rooms love exploring in here let's go
I got this for Bailey because she needs a new daddy. For Bailey, ready, spaghetti, go! A good girl. Oh, that's your new toy. For Bailey. Bailey's new toy. Bye. <laughs> I'm back home now so I'll quickly take you through absolutely everything I picked up for eBay to sell and then also personal pickups and the breakdown of what I expect to get back on those items so let's go Okay, so let's break it down. We've got 47 items altogether. The total cost of goods for all of them was $142. So if we're saying that we could get an average of $15 per item gross, which is conservative and um, you know some items are gonna go for higher, lower, some might not sell at all. So then our eBay fees on that would be $89.55. So we'll minus that minus the cost of goods and we're left with a net profit of $473.45. After an awesome day out in Gloucester, I love going there. It's fun. I had an awesome day with my friend. I enjoy thrifting. I found personal items and this return of investment after putting in the effort on my eBay store with listing these items, I'm really happy with this outcome. Since it's Friday, I thought I'd just quickly show you what's also sold for me for the last couple of days. So starting off, we have this really nice bodycon dress from Joseph Ribkoff, great brand to look out for. And this one went for $45 plus postage. Really cute little boho dress. The brand isn't much, but this boho style goes really well. So $20 plus shipping on that one. Next up is a bundle sale. So on the top, we've got this floral piece from Witchery. Really nice layered effect on that one. And then we've got this boho blouse on top. It's just a fast fashion brand. But again, like I said, this boho style goes really well. And uh, being new with tags is fantastic. And we're keeping it out of landfill a little bit longer. So that together went for $54 plus postage. You can see here they paid $20 in postage. So I will have to refund them as they've paid for postage on both items. This piece is really cool because it's so inconspicuous. So the brand is Icebreaker, but it is 100% New Zealand merino wool. So this piece went for $39 plus postage. Next up is another awesome bundle sale. We've got four men's button-up shirts, all in a size large. Most of them are the Gazman brand. Really stylish pieces. This one's bamboo, so nice and lightweight for summer. 
So all four of these pieces went for a total of $60 plus postage. And then a cute little gander piece, just a little crop jumper. This one went for 18 plus postage. Finally, in the clothing, I got a whole heap of these Sports Girl uh, A-line skirts. They're all brand new with tags, but they all are a size 6. So uh, being a size 6, they're a little bit slower to sell. Uh, but this one went for $29 plus postage. Finally, in today's sales are three Funko Pops going out. So we've got Stan Lee. He went for $45 free shipping. Then we've got this ACDC album set that went for $34 free shipping. And then finally, we've got the main character from American Psycho. He went for $44 free shipping. <laughs> 